Gaziantep, a city whose roots go back more than 10,000 years. A vital bridge that has been connecting the Mediterranean basin to Mesopotamia throughout history. A key production hub and trade post on the Silk Road, where Eastern and Western values have been amalgamated seamlessly. After thousands of years of prominence, Gaziantep is still teeming with energy. After all, according to the World Bank, it is the seventh most competitive city in the world. Gaziantep has been one of the gastronomic hubs in Turkey. UNESCO recognized the Gaziantep cuisine as one of the most creative in the world. And European Commission announced that Gaziantep is a European destination of excellence in regard to gastronomy. The city is home to some of the most astonishing museums and historical sites in Mesopotamia. Clearly, Gaziantep had a beautiful story, and they hired I Mean It to tell it. Our first task was to establish an inclusive process that would maximize stakeholder engagement. Gaziantep is a large and diverse city with multiple stakeholders having different priorities. So we positioned the branding project as an open invitation to a city-wide conversation. We made sure that all major stakeholders, from the mayor's office to the governor to the chamber of industry to the Board of Tourism were involved in important decisions. We interviewed the key decision makers and opinion leaders. We opted for appreciative inquiry, focusing on possibilities, potentials and dreams, and not problems. In addition to providing invaluable insight, the interviews also served as a tool to make people feel that they were involved in shaping the desired future state of their city. Unlike many other place branding projects, we did not want the information that we unearthed through the interviews to go to waste. So we shot some parts of the interviews, made dozens of one-minute videos, and used those clips to boost citywide buy-in. Finally, we transformed the interview scripts into a book that tells the story of the project. We also wanted to get the citizens engaged, so we held painting sessions with hundreds of kids. We asked them to paint the Gaziantep they see in their dreams. In addition to the stakeholder interviews and workshops, we also conducted a thorough global best practices audit, as well as analyzing key place branding trends. We amalgamated our findings with the results of a nationwide city perception survey. When we connected the dots, a clear picture emerged. The branding project had three objectives. One, to position Gaziantep as a city worth visiting. Two, to make the city more livable. And three, to inspire and encourage the business people of Gaziantep to create global brands. That meant we had to find a positioning idea wide enough to accommodate all three objectives and authentic enough to be compelling. That idea was mastery. Throughout history, Gaziantep's people always stood out with their mastery. The grand masters of Middle Eastern cuisine often came from Gaziantep. Arguably the best baklava in the world is made in Gaziantep. The city was famous for its coppersmiths. It had been one of the global centers of weaving. Some of the best mosaic examples in human history could be found in Gaziantep. Because Gaziantep was not just a city, it is a masterly state of mind. From architecture, to municipal management, to handicrafts, to industry, to cuisine, to entertainment. Everything the people of Gaziantep touched took on a masterly form. So by creating a tagline as Turkey's masterly people, we branded the Gaziantep's genius loci, the city's presiding spirit. We shot a short video to tell the story of and the idea behind the new brand. Thank you. 
Have you ever been surprised by the rising morning sun while working? Even though you knew it would go unnoticed, have you spent hours on a small detail? Whatever it is that you do, have you ever lost yourself doing it? Then been stunned by the result with appreciation? Have you ever learned something by heart just through observation and practice? Have your hands, by themselves, worked as if they knew what they were doing? Have you secretly felt angry at those who told you it wasn't worth it? Did you ever build something piece by piece, thread by thread, letter by letter, something big, ever been infused by the sound of a fabric, the scent of copper, or the taste of the sun, deep in your soul? Have you ever felt happy when tired? They call it the weary happiness. Did you ever feel at home among others like yourself? Then, you too are from Gaziantep. Our next task was to create a public face for the new brand. After rounds of explorations, we brought the brand to life by designing a logo based on geometric patterns. The design chosen was a metaphor, representing the productivity and unity of the people of Gaziantep. In addition to the logo, a custom-made font was designed for the brand. The proprietary font named Gaziantep was based on a special grid system, which symbolically represented the people of Gaziantep's industriousness. The brand's thorough visual identity included different color scheme suggestions to represent strategic categories. Moreover, key quotes from the interviews were used as part of a billboard campaign to raise awareness. We also introduced a sound logo. The logo's manifestations are planned to be used in various places, such as the airport terminal, public transportation buses, municipal call centers, and local chambers dial lines. 
We created visual guidelines that articulate design principles and usage specifications of the new visual identity. We designed templates for the stationary suite, as well as collateral systems reflecting the new identity. To promote Gaziantep's most important tourist attractions, we shot a mini documentary series. The host, Jeffrey Young, introduced the unique objects and historical treasures of Gaziantep. In a series of two-minute upbeat documentaries, We commissioned top photographers to capture the city's breathtaking vistas and most unique values. Those photos were used in promotional brochures, tour guides, and press kits. Finally, we created a destination website for Gaziantep, created and managed the brand's social media activities, including its Facebook page, Twitter account, and Instagram page. A historic city, a masterly people, and an authentic brand that stemmed from the place's spirit. That's the Gaziantep Branding Project in a nutshell.